Hey everybody. So we're trying to answer the problem. What is the area of an equilateral triangle whose altitude is six? So here's the picture. True picture of our equilateral triangle. Remember an equilateral triangle has three 60 degree angles. The one up here is cut by the altitude. So instead of being 60 degrees, each of these angles is 30, adds up to 60, right? So I redrew half of this triangle over here. And if you remember, there's a special relationship between uh, a right triangle that's a 30, 60, 90 triangle. And what's the relationship? It's the relationships of the side lengths. So the side length across from a 30 degree angle, if it's one, then the side length across from the 90 degree angle is double that, so it would be two. And then the side length across from the 60 degree angle is whatever this length is, the one times radical three. So this is our relationship. However, we don't have radical three over two as our altitude. I mean, radical three, we just have six. All right, so how do we figure this out? We ideally wanna find this length here, right? Why is that? Because area of a triangle is base times our altitude six divided by two. So if we find half of this length and double it, we'll get the length of our base. So to get from one to radical three, we had to multiply by radical three, but we're going backwards. We wanna get from the altitude to the base. So how do we do that? We're gonna to have to divide by radical three. So we're gonna to have to take six and divide it by radical three. So here's the problem right here. How do we do that? I've written it as a fraction. Because remember, a fraction bar is the same thing as division. But we never wanna leave a radical three in the denominator. So how do we eliminate that? Well, we multiply it by radical three over radical three. Why is that? Well, anything divided by itself is just one, right? So I haven't changed the nature of the problem, but in doing this, look what happens. Multiply across the top, I get six radical three. Multiply across the bottom, anything under a radical sign multiplied by itself is the number inside. So radical three times radical three is plain all three. Now look what happens. I can simplify the whole number. Six divided by three is two. Okay, so what have I just calculated? I calculated half of this length, it's two radical three. So if half of it is two radical three, the other half is two radical three, so what's the length of the entire base? What's two radical three plus two radical three? It is four radical three. So we're gonna plug it into our area formula, our base times our height divided by two. So let's look at the denominator. Two is carried across, let's look at the numerator. Six times four is 24, radical three. Can we simplify the whole numbers? Yes, 24 divided by two is 12. So the area of this equilateral triangle whose altitude is six is 12 radical three. That's a lot of radicals, hope it helps. Bye.